at 1030, it's never too early to start thinking about the holidays. In fact, one organization got a head start on helping the community today. News 9's Claire O'Neill has more. With the holiday season right around the corner, the Salvation Army is offering Christmas signups for those looking for a little extra help. Now, applications can be filled out in Ohio, Marshall, Wetzel, and Tyler counties, and it qualifies families for the Angel Tree Program, Coats for Kids, and Holiday Meal Assistance. The nonprofit was able to help out over 750 children last year, and they've already ordered $1,800 worth of coats this year. There are so many people in need in our communities, and we don't want to see a kid go without. We're not talking about, you know, they, we're not talking about PS5s. We're talking about basic needs, basic toys for those kids, clothing, so that they have an opportunity to put that smile on a kid's face on Sunday morning. The Angel Tree Program provides kids from birth to 16 years old with Christmas presents. The trees will be located in different spots throughout the Ohio Valley. Take care of that child that you pick off that angel tree like you would for your own. If you would want your child to have it, that's what you would want them to have. And so it's such a blessing to see how sometimes uh, grandmothers or businesses will go out and they'll go shopping for these angels just like they're shopping for their ki own kids. People can apply both in person and online through the end of October and a schedule with office hours can be found at WTOV9.com. From toys to clothes, all of this can really make the holidays worthwhile to assist families for the cold holiday season ahead. So apply or lend a hand if you can. And they can go ahead and get signed up. Last year we did 505 kids on the Angel Tree program and we ended up helping another 250 with a toy shop afterwards. This year we're looking to put as many on the Angel Tree as possible. Those are the ones that are going to get um, the gifts that are bought for them by the general public. And so we're trying to just be out there to do that. To find out more about some of these programs, you can find a link to that on our website, WTOV9.com. Reporting in the Wheeling Content Center, I'm Claire O'Neill, News 9.